Hello, fellow Who Reviews and Mr. Who Reviews. And today, if you want to share Jane Ministers, The Lost Boy. And this is the last episode for season one. And in it, these uh, two people uh, say they've um, lost their son for five months. And they also picked her up to get in the news, and it's Luke. And Sir Jane, Luke himself, Maria, and her dad are just uh, shocked. And Sir Jane has uh, Mr. Smith uh, scan Luke to see if he and uh, the kid, uh, Ashley, are the same person. Mr. Smith say that they are. And Marie's mom calls the cops on Sarah Jane. Yeah. And I think the opening for this was kind of good. It's uh, having flashbacks or recaps from the past few episodes. And Marie's dad saying up at the house on market. And then Marie's a song Sarah Jane trying to convince her, trying to get her to convince the dad not to sell, but. Sarah Jane does make a good point. The dad's thinking about um, Maria's safety and that. But. Mm. Anyway, uh, Sarah Jane just tried to talk to Luke going to meet his uh, parents. And yeah, they get into a bit of a fight and just the uh, emotions lose uh, after. So this when Sarah Jane can take away by the police is very good. I think. And just the emotions certainly are a little bit slating souls and this is great as well. Just pretend to be happy for Luke funny funny his parents you know, you know he's, he's devastated. That's my uh, lose the, the person that he thought of as a son for five months or whatever. And uh, then just uh, being a bit cold to Maria saying she wouldn't want anything to do with or Clyde again. And they do make a, a good point of uh, Luke not being the like uh, the parent the son of the people that lost the kid the kid since he's not a Benny Button man and he, he even says he doesn't remember having any parents. Hmm. Um yeah the 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 couple aren't Luke's parents they're Slavain. And the uh, Slavain saw back in the uh, the uh, second story as he returns and yeah, he's a, a little brat in and out of uh, the skin suit. Oh yeah, this time the Slavain skin suits are skinny. Apparently the gas skin is, uh, is better but the dad and it doesn't find it comfortable. Yeah. Anyway, Clyde actually sneaks away from school to uh, see Luke and the man just looks at angry at, her, at, at him. Uh, he doesn't, yeah, it gets a bit, a bit suspicious when Mom said he got uh, Luke, or she got Luke a, a skateboard for pretending he was great at it, but it turns out that Luke is terrible with, with skateboard. And, uh, Mr. Smith had Sarah Jane go to this, uh, a scientific, uh, group called the Ferros Institute, Institute that study, uh, as a paranormal type stuff, like, uh, psychic abilities. I'm sure they made this, uh, headset called a uh, Mita that can uh, channel a uh, human's psychic abilities to make, to do, to do psychic stuff. But more like telekinesis and psychic, but hmm. and uh, it turns out the spider and Mr. Smith is partnering up with the Slavine. And in the second part, part that's yeah, uh, that he gave Mr. Smith uh, ordens. Turns out uh, he's part of this uh, creature called Zylock. 
a kind of a crystal-like life form that crash landed on Earth it's about a billion or something years ago. And, uh, he, uh, he's actually uh, been manipulating Sergei and the Slavine to get his, uh, the other part of the Zog out of the Earth. Uh, but if he does that, the Earth will be destroyed, since so he uses the Mita device to, with the Luke to pull this, the moon from orbit and make it crash on Earth. Yeah, and the reason that Savine are here because it Mr. Massey contacted him and saying he could help with their revenge on Sarah Zane and uh, they can make a lot of money with the psychic energy Luke has. And Mr. Massey trapped Clyde in, in himself. Well, Clyde is a bit of a smart kid that said somehow uh, using a Something Mr. Smith to contact the Maria's dad on the computer. Pretty good. And to remember, dad had this uh, Armageddon code at some some uh, terrors or something while using banks, and that used that to uh, cause them Mr. Smith to reboot and forget some stuff. Oh yeah, K Nine comes in for the. Defense when uh, it turns out Mr. Smith has a cannon coming out of uh, one of the one of the parts of him. Yeah, and later on he has a fan. I don't know. So, uh, I don't think it's a good thing in the K9. And everything seems um, well. Even Maria's uh, mom seems pleasant. Seems to uh, give out seeing her name. Or her daughter or Luke, even though she did think she kidnapped him. Uh, well. Anyway, yeah, I think this is like a good season finale for uh, certain investors, but I think some of the future ones are a bit better. And the second part of the story is good and does a lot of the act, most of the acting is very good. And uh, music goes well, and it's me or when uh, Luca trying to escape from uh, the, his uh, parents' house, and, and the music playing one of the pieces of music sounds like a like arrow being fired or something. That's just that's what I, I think. And uh, I don't know why the Zylock. Um, and uh, like the, what I was talking to, sort of emails are in their human uh, skin suits and in a house that he looks different with the lights and that. So, mm. and the person voicing Mr. Smith does a great job turn heel, and his evil laugh is that uh, good, I think. Now, I don't know if I'm gonna continue with uh, the Strange Ram Strange Ram I think it depends. On how many views this and the other uh, uh, videos I get, so just keep watching. And uh, yeah, that's it. I'm See you guys later.